What are you buying? Aspartame! Why? Because it's good for you. name for brand names NutraSweet, Equal, Spoonful and Equal Measure. It was discovered by accident in 1965 when James Schlatter, a chemist of GD Cereal Company, was testing an anti-ulcer drug. What types of products contain aspartame? It is currently consumed by over 200 million people around the world and is found in more than 6,000 products. We can find aspartame in sugar-free and low-calorie products such as sugar-free soda. Of aspartame. Right there. Sugar-free bubble gum. Sugar-free yogurt. Sugar-free candy. Low calorie supplements. I'm about to eat some aspartame tonight. Why is aspartame used? Very little is needed for a sweet taste, making aspartame virtually non caloric. Aspartame is about 200 times sweeter than sugar, tastes good, enhances citrus and other fruit flavors, saves calories and does not contribute to tooth decay. So, if you consume aspartame, this cannot happen to you. What is aspartame made of? Aspartame is made by joining two protein components, aspartic acid and phenylalanine, and small amounts of methanol. Aspartic acid and phenylalanine are building blocks of protein and are found naturally in all protein containing foods including meats, grains and diet products. Methanol is found naturally in the body and in many foods such as fruit and vegetable juices. How is aspartame handled by the body? Aspartame is digested just like any other protein. Upon digestion, aspartame breaks down into basic components and is absorbed into blood. Neither aspartame nor its components accumulate in the body over time. Your body loves aspartame. Do you want a disc? This? No, there's no aspartame. Take it. What is methanol and why is it a problem in consuming aspartame? Methanol is a natural and harmless byproduct of metabolization of many commonly consumed foods. The methanol produced by metabolism of aspartame is identical to that, to that which is provided in much larger amounts from fruits, vegetables and their juices and is part of the normal diet. In fact, a glass of apple juice provides six times as much methanol as a similar amount of diet soda. During the metabolization of aspartame in the gastrointestinal tract, methanol is released and then metabolized by normal body processes. Numerous scientific studies have shown that methanol derived from aspartame does not accumulate in the body and thus cannot reach harmful levels. Can pregnant women consume aspartame? A task force of an American Academy of Pediatrics Committee on Nutrition conducted that aspartame is safe for both mother and developing baby. Of course, it is important for all pregnant women to consult with their doctors regarding nutritional needs during pregnancy. Hey, are you pregnant? Yes. Ah! Hey, take some aspartame. Okay. 
Oh, I can see the head. Can people with diabetes consume aspartame? The American Diabetes Association has stated that aspartame is acceptable as a sugar substitute and can be included in a diabetic meal plan. Is aspartame safe for people with epilepsy? The Epilepsy Institute, an organization devoted to people suffering from seizure-related problems, has concluded that aspartame is not related to seizures among epileptic patients. Is there any relationship between aspartame and cancer or tumor formation? It is psychologically impossible for aspartame to be carcinogen. Aspartame is broken down in the gastrointestinal tract to small amounts of common dietary components in including the amino acids, aspartic acid, and phenylalanine. We consume these same components in much greater amounts in common foods such as milk, meat, fruits, and vegetables. The body handles these amino acids in the same way it handles them from other food sources. Aspartame itself never enters the bloodstream. In addition, Tests of abused doses of aspartame in rats and mice showed no evidence of brain tumors or any kind of tumors. Has aspartame been found to affect children's behavior? Studies have shown that aspartame consumption does not affect the behavior of children, including those diagnosed with hyperactive or with attention deficit disorder. So if your children act like this, it has nothing to do with aspartame. They are just simply crazy. Rockin' the beat, come on! Hey!